areas, profile flushing, telephone number 07836 353985. We're in Preston today doing a power flush. The system was completely blocked. Uh, no central heating at all, boiler kettling, cutting out, plumbers called out, etc. New pump put on the system. The system still did not work. The boiler was overheating, um, cutting out, blowing fuses, etc. Okay, we're just going to show you the pump uh, valve which we've taken off. Full of rust and corrosion. Can you see that small hole? There's my finger there. That hole there should be as big as that one there. Yeah? And the pads were also like this. We had to actually cut a little few bits of the... We had to actually get into the pipes, basically. And uh, prod them, put chemical in them. Um, and now we've hooked up with a, with a power flush machine as well. And we're getting all this rust and corrosion out of the central heating system. Okay? So, uh, if you don't know what a power flush is, we'll quickly explain. Power flushing is just a means of flushing through all your central heating system. Your radiators, your pipe work, your boiler, etc. Um, we're just going to go and check a few things and we'll get back to you shortly, okay? Thanks. So, we'll just zoom in a bit. Yeah, so, uh, um, just back to this job in Preston. Uh, so, we're, we're basically power flushing the whole central heating system. We've already broken through the blockages. We're getting a great flow around the central heating system. And um, the job's going okay. All this rust and corrosion, we're going to show you the colour of the water. It's completely black like engine oil. Really, really bad. We've got the magnet hooked up there as well. We're going to check that later and see what we've got out of this system but obviously it was very 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 extremely bad system if, if, the, if the boiler wasn't working at the end of the day <coughs> excuse me because of all the blockages it doesn't get much worse basically okay we stood away from the fume because we've got the uh, cf210 titan powerful powerful shield, powerful powerful shield pump on the go and the magna hooked up and we've got fx2 chemical in there to break through all them uh, blockages all that corrosion and rust and metal etc Alright, um, we've actually taken a pump off, hooked in through there, uh, we do the job 100% properly, okay? The areas we cover, we're based in Bramall, Stockport, Manchester, and we cover a 60 to 70 mile radius of our hometown, hence us being in Preston today. It's Sunday today, it's March 2018, um, you know, we have been quite busy lately because of the winter, um, but, you know, we, we do go the extra mile to... Um, you know, to, to try and help our customers out. We've got a similar job tomorrow in Stafford. Uh, we're off to Stafford tomorrow. Um, same thing. Apparently, the, the boiler is just—it's just not working. It's, the system's completely blocked for of rust and, and corrosion. But we'll get back to you tomorrow now about that, and um, we'll probably make another video and show you what's uh, going on with that central heating system. Okay, so we've got a lot to do. We'll just show you the colour of the water, and we'll get back to you later on. Okay, thank you. Okay, Barry Iceball Power Flushing, just back to this job in Preston. Um, what we showed you there, uh, we showed you the water that was in the header tank, rusty corroded water, we showed you the Sentinel, which we're going to be adding later, we'll add that actually in the machine, because we've got, got some new central heating pump valves on this um, central heating system, so we can trap that in the system basically. And we showed you the magnet, that's the rust and corrosion coming out of the system. And there were some massive pieces on there as well. We're going to zoom in again on it. We just stood back here because the machine's quite noisy. We're still flushing it out. We've still got the chemical in there. But let's show. Let's zoom in on this magnet. Right. Can you see that rust, corrosion, and metal? This is why this central heating system wasn't working whatsoever. Okay. It was full of rust, metal and corrosion in the central heating system. And there's some really big flakes of rust on there as well. This is what blocking, blocking the pipes up, uh, the pump valves, etc. Okay, the boiler. Just blocking everything up and we've got this out of the central heating system. So this is what it's all about. Now you imagine fitting a new boiler, I'm just going to zoom back out a little bit. You imagine fitting a new boiler and all this rust and corrosion going through the system. 
yeah? We've been to many central heating boilers that have just broken down within the first month or so. You know, because the system wasn't powerful, the, the engineer, you know, the engineers, boiler fitters, they've come round and fitted a boiler, not powerful the system. All this nastiness, all this rust and corrosion has got into the boiler and it's blocked it up. You know what I mean? And um, we've had to go on powerful system to get the boiler up and running again. Not only that, it can actually write your boiler off this stuff. If this really gets proper into the heat exchanger, starts getting baked on there because there's no flow through there and the boiler's getting hot, it's, it's, you know, it could write your boiler off. So um, it's of the utmost importance that you get your central heating system power flushed. Um, this is obviously an old system which is broken down, but even new systems break down if they're not clean enough. If they're not properly central, if they're not power flushed, the BS 7593 standard, as in the way we're doing it now, um, you know, you're, you're just going to ask for trouble. You're going to be asking for trouble. We quickly show you upstairs where the pipes are, where we're hooked in. This isn't, you know, this is no DIY job. I'm, I'm, I'm only showing you this uh, because, you know, to show you we know what we're doing. And really, I'm the guy you should be calling to uh, sort your central heating system out if it's blocked up like this, basically. Okay, so um, we'll just quickly show you upstairs and uh, we'll get back to you later when the job's done now, basically. Okay, talk to you later, thanks. We're just hooked in now, taking the pump off, putting the pump valves on. Uh, we're actually going to try the pump later as well um, just to make sure it's working okay just before we put it, put it back on we're going to wire it up and see make sure it's working basically all right we'll get back to you later thanks. Hi, Barry, it's pro path pushing okay it's path push done now and pressed and everything's heating up nice radiator it's getting nice and warm the boilers turned down nice and quiet no banging or kettling or anything so uh, com a complete success on this job so if you need anything like this doing, give me a call on telephone number 07836 353 985 or contact us through our website propowerflushing.co.uk okay, okay, just back to this job in uh, Preston uh, I'm not sure if we told you about our prices but our price is up to 50% cheaper than the major utility companies such as British Gas Home Serve, Eon, etc. Our work is fully certificated to BS7593 standard you will receive a certificate upon completion of the power flush stating the power flush has been done and it's been done correctly this is all okay with the service provider whether it be British Gas Home Serve, Eon, etc. Okay, um, fully gas I'm a fully gas registered engineer also. Obviously, sometimes we have to get right into the boilers. Um, if your engineer is not gas safe registered, make sure he is, basically, because we have to get into the boilers, take components off, and, um, you know, basically make sure your engineer knows what they're doing. Yeah? I've literally done hundreds of power flushes. Um, I know what I'm doing basically, it's me who turns up Barry has to do the power push, uh, there's no one works for me, just me, um, so you're going to get my expertise and my experience on your job, okay, um, that's about it, we'll, uh, we'll just, uh, next time we get back to you we're going to show you the magnet, we're going to clean the header tank out in the, in the loft area also, um, and we'll just get back to you later now, thanks.